Hi everyone and welcome back to another video. In today's video I'm going to talk to you a bit about what is up in store for English 11 week 4. Now if you take a look at our landing page you'll see that we have updated what we are doing and also the kind of work that you should be doing outside of class. This week is going to be the start of you know our moth project. So our focus is going to be mainly on looking at examples and then also taking notes about those examples and trying to find what makes a good moth story. That is really the big focus of this week. In terms of the kind of work that you should be doing or that you can expect, so on Monday we are going to Monday and Tuesday we're going to be watching some moth stories together as a class and taking some notes on that. And then outside of class on Wednesday we want you to also take a look at another moth story of your choice and you'll get a couple choices to choose from and then you'll be completing the note sheet for that as well and this will all be explained to you in class also and you'll get to see lots of examples of how you should be completing this note sheet. Lastly, you're going to create your own book choice post and each teacher is doing something a little bit different maybe, so check in with your teacher about specifically what your class is doing for this. But otherwise, it's a pretty short week in terms of the kind of work you can expect. But we are ramping up to eventually writing our own moth stories, which I know some of you are super excited for and some of you are going to be like, oh, writing. But trust me, this is going to be really fun. I think a lot of you are going to enjoy writing the moth story and then getting to tell your moth story because it's all about you. It's not just like a plain school essay. It is about you. So if you've got any questions, please feel, re feel free to reach out to your English 11 teacher. Enjoy and have a great day, y'all.